I warned John this would happen. But he couldn't leave the North and expect her to just sit and wait for him like Ghost. He didn't. He trusted you to hold it for him. Well, he's not making it easy. The Northern Lords are proud. These are mother and father's chambers. And? Nothing. Don't do that. What? Say what you mean. You always liked nice things. Made you feel better than everyone. Are you angry with me? They were insulting John. And you sat there and listened. I listened to their complaints, which is my responsibility as Lady of Winterfell. Their opinions are important to you. Glover has 500 men, Royce has 2,000. Offend them, and John loses his army. Not if they lose their heads first. Winterfell didn't just fall into our hands. We took it back. And the Mormonts, and the Hornwoods, and the Wildlings, and the Vale, all of us working together. Now, I'm sure cutting off heads is very satisfying, but that's not the way you get people to work together. And if John doesn't come back, you'll need their support. So you can work together to give you what you really want. How can you even think such a horrible thing? You're thinking it right now. You don't want to be. But the thought just won't go away. I have work to do. My lady. <laughs>